Good morning. This is Amber. You can find me on Instagram and Ravelry as Ampy Marie Knits. It is Saturday, May 13th, and I did not get that much stuff done this week. Um, work is a little bit different because I'm helping with a training class, so I don't have as much time to just sit down and do the stuff I would rather be doing, but it's okay. Uh, we're going to start with what am I wearing? This is my Rumble Raglan by Lady Amaro. It is made out of Pretty Twisted Yarns. Pink is Owl Will Always Love You. Orange is Popportunity. And the speckle is Are We Having Fun Fetty Yet? This was a really fun make. I really like the two by two color work on it and just the way the colors change. It would have been nice if maybe I'd gotten Gage. It is too big. This should have negative ease. It does not. My yoke's a little bit too deep, but I still do like it, and the colors are really nice, and it is very cozy. Um, as far as finished objects goes, I have one. It's interesting. The Afterthought Everything Socks, they're done. I did have some problems with them. So I made a giant tube from toe to toe, and then I cut down the middle. I counted my rows thought I counted them the same. I did not. So I wound up having to make them a little bit shorter than I was anticipating so they were the same size. And then I added a cuff and then just an afterthought heel. Um, yarn striping is Knit Picks Felici Summer Nights. The orange is something I dyed. I don't even know. Just a scrap that I had. These are going to be a birthday slash Mother's Day present for my mom. And I will see her today to be able to gift them to her so she won't see this before it happens. Um, as far as what I've been working on, let's see, new projects that I've started. Um, I've got a friend that's having a birthday party for her twin boys. They turn one next week. So I am making them bears. The pattern is the, oh, I can't think of the name of it. It's a scrappy bear. Um, it is by Susan Claudino. Um, so far I have, not doing it scrappy, but I have two feet, two arms, two ears. Oh, they're so cute little ears. Done. Um, I started the body this morning, but I didn't get very far. It's just that. But it's going pretty fast. I'm using, it's supposed to be held double, but I'm using just one strand of DK weight on size threes, and it should make a decent size little bear. Yarn is Knit Pick Swish that I dyed, so it's just a red color. Um, the bag I have this in is actually really cool. This is Ginger Snap Fibers. And just a pretty awesome skull bag. I think skulls are perfectly fine all year round. Does not need to wait till Halloween. Um, next up that I've been working on, my muscle wear hat. I didn't do really much on it this week. It's in my bag from the Naughty Nitrous. Um, this is a yarn from Arkansas Yarn Co. I got that much done. From here up, that's it. Just a little bit. Haven't been able to knit at work, so not much got done on it. And then next up that I've gotten some done on the past couple days is a bag by me. A um, pair of socks. This is Knit Picks Felici. Um, colorway is Bookshop. Um, I think, I think I was like down here somewhere, just past the toe last week. Um, did a shadow rope heel. Um, this is quickly, used to always do fish lip kiss heels. And I like the fish lips kiss heel, but the shadow wrap heel, you don't have to think as much. 
um, just the way it works. So I would definitely recommend trying it. It's by Earth Tones Girl. She has a free YouTube tutorial that you can look up. Um, yeah, I know it messed with the striping, but I didn't care. I needed something to work on. Um, this will actually come in handy because my 18 year old son graduates high school this evening. So this will be coming with me as something to do while we're waiting on the however many other kids are going to be going as well. So that will be fun. Um, next up, my bluegrass shawl. It's going to be fun. We got a little bit done. From the lemon stitch marker. I got this stitch markers from Arkansas Yarn Co. as well. It came in one of the Sock Yarn Society boxes. But I got that much done. It's, it's getting bigger. Um, I think I counted. I'm 20 out of 65 repeats done. So almost a third of the way. I love it though. Fringe is looking all fringy. And it's just still so squishy. Most of this Pretty Twisted Yarns scraps from the 2022 Advent, um, but there's also some from the Cat Lady Advent from 2022? No, 2021, I think is what that one was from. Um, some of that and just random whatever stuff I happen to grab when I need to kind of mix up the colors a little bit. Um, bags in here on the ones that I made. Old Christmas one. I don't want to see the colors when I pull them out, so I can be surprised. And then this one's Black Pearl Magic. That's all that I've been actively working on, but I am planning, hopefully this weekend or next weekend, starting the Secret Summer Crop for my son's girlfriend. Um, that's going to be out of Moonlow, Moonglow Yarn Co. And also discovered that there is a knit along starting uh, the 26th it is for the brioche mode shawl by susan summer um and it's a four color shawl it's a mystery you get a clue each week for four weeks so i'm going through my yarns trying to see what i can come up with that um i really want to use yarn that i've dyed but I'm having, of course, a hard time trying to pick what colors to use because it needs to be more of like a solid speckle tonal type thing instead of variegated. So we will see what happens there. Um, as far as reading goes, I'm still reading the Anne Bishop other series. I think I'm a book five or six. I don't know which one. It's called Etched in Bone. It's amazing. I wish I had more time to read it. But hopefully I will get that done this week. And then I'll be able to start on the next set of series from the others. Um, watching. I don't watch much other than just other people's YouTube channels. But I did watch Cocaine Bear last weekend. And by watch it, I mean I put in my earbuds and I watched YouTube while it was playing on the TV in my living room. Because it's a little bit too gory for me personally. But I can definitely see the appeal for some people on it. Um, life stuff. My son graduates high school today. So family's coming down. We're going to have dinner. And that is exciting. Um, also, I don't have any acquisitions this week. But I should next week. Because Pretty Twisted Yarns may have done a shop update yesterday. And I may have gotten a whole bunch of fun stuff that I'll be excited to share. Oh, the other thing. I did have somebody ask the blanket behind me. Crocheted blanket. I don't remember the pattern. I had a book that had like a hundred different ripple stitches or something like that in it. I used it from that. Yarn is at least mostly the mainstays yarn from Walmart. There may be some Red Heart in here. I am not for sure. And I actually made this winter of 2019. Um, like, that's when I started. I've always knit and crochet. Um, the times of my life when it was biggest was about 2010, then it slowly slacked off. And then into 2019 was when I got really into it. And then, of course, 2020 is when I learned that hand-dyed yarn was a thing and I could start buying that and enjoying it. 
so that's everything for this week. I hope everybody has a great Mother's Day and thank you for watching.